Hello, uh, welcome to today's video. Uh, we've got a high long battery in. It's a uh, 36 volt, 13 amp hour pack. Uh, what's happening is, if you turn the switch on, you've got two lights indicating it's kind of half charged. Charger stays green, doesn't go red. If we look at the voltage of the battery output, we get 36 volts with the charger in, 36 with the charger unplugged, it stays the same. I'm thinking unhappy charge port or wires come off, something like that, but um, let's take a look and see. Fits nicely, that fits nicely. This is a Posi 2 or Phillips head 2. Fits nicely. Got screws all the way around the outside of these high long packs. Four, five, six, seven, eight up here. warranty sticker here that's not yet been broken. I'd like to leave it that way. Okay, we've got, it's all quite nice in here, um, XD60s, XD30 on the charge port, them out of the way so I don't lose them. Uh, we've got on the switch which seems to be working right there and the charge port here. Let's measure the output of the charge port and see what we get at these terminals here. I don't know if you can even see the meter. Got 42 volts coming out to that connector there. But for some reason the BMS isn't letting it take a charge. Ah, there's a fuse. There's a fuse. Here's the fuse. I think the fuse is blown. Yep, it is. Blown fuse there. Now, why that would be, I don't know. Charge port doesn't look like it's shorted out or anything. But what I'll do, I'll get my replacement fuses here. In there was a 10 amp fuse. So we'll replace it with a 10 amp fuse, like this one, a non-blown 10 amp fuse. And we'll connect the charger. Hey! Red light, charging. So, blown fuse. All good. Thanks for watching.